I'm Dr. Nandita Palshetkar with 30 years of experience in IVF and medical director of Bloom IVF. Today, I'm going to be talking about the complications of IVF. Uh, normally, the complications of IVF are, uh, they are divided into different parts. First part is ovulation. Ovulation can become hyperstimulation, ovarian hyperstimulation. You know, you produce a lot of eggs say 20, 25 and on. So this is a complication which we don't want. So we uh, start the lower dose depending on the AMH, the body weight of the patient and the sonography, the antral follicle count. The other complication is we may not get any eggs at all. Sometimes patient is a poor responder and you don't get any eggs at all. So one egg, two eggs and you're seeing it on the sonography and when you do ovum pickup, there are no eggs at all. The other complication are complications of anesthesia while doing the pickup, but they are very rare. The main complication of IVF is multiple pregnancies. When we put back two babies or three babies, the chance of multiple pregnancy is about 10%. And that is something that we are trying to reduce so that the burden to the patient will be less. The other complications are sometimes the patient can land up with preterm labor, small babies. And also remember that IVF is one third of the IVF patients are above 40 years of age. So there is an increased incidence of diabetes, of blood pressure, IUGR, meaning uh, small babies, our preterm births. And these are the things that we have to look out for.